Hey, how's it going, everyone? Hope you're all having a great day. I definitely am. Today I'm being joined by Stephen here. Today we're checking out the local river, which we've been to last year. But we're going to explore some new parts of it, and I'll be telling like a story of what happened a couple of years ago, well, actually five years ago. It was like a lightning story, so stay tuned for that. And I hope you all enjoy this vlog. So, we'll see you soon. Everyone, so now we are down at the river. It's right here. Yeah, I'm um, pretty recently they put in this really big ugly pipe, which is for the irrigation scheme they're putting in. It comes from the Rakai River. So we were just down here. Once when we came down here, it was really cool because there was actually water flying down these tracks. But there isn't quite enough water right now. These cars are looking pretty dark, so hopefully it doesn't rain while we're out. But yeah, so we're just going to start exploring it, so enjoy the videos I get of the river. Alright everyone, so I just did the first of many river crossings, I just nearly put my foot down into a hole that had some water. It's just behind me, the first river crossing, there's probably going to be over 10 river crossings, um, I just have to be extremely careful with my gimbal. Um, there was this piece of river that was like shown just before, that was pretty deep, it would be a really good swimming hole. Um, it was kind of like, had like an olive tint, probably because of all the algae and stuff. But yeah, it's summer right now, it's just because it's been so much rain, there's quite a bit of water when there's usually no water, so we're just going to continue on our exploration of the river. There's some pretty big ass trees behind me. I'll show you in a sec, so enjoy. Second river crossing, and here is the ugly pipe. There's probably eels in there. Alrighty one, so um, we just had a bit of a roadblock um, right behind me. If you can see there, basically the river goes into a part where there's no land and it's really deep and swift and there's this little creek right behind me just there if you can see it um, where like it joins into the river so we're just going to head around it which is right behind me just here we're going to go around it and see where this takes us Oh, it's a bit slippery So um, while we're walking through this bit of a forest part because we couldn't get through the river, we had to go into the forest, we found this rusty looking oil um, pellet thingy, whatever you call it. 
um, just here, the river is just over here. And it's weird as like lots of poles which have good swimming holes, it's just not that good for getting across. So we're just continuing on, this cool bind right here. So let's continue on through the forest. What's over here? <laughs> hey everyone, so um, we're just come to the uh, cross section where there's just quite a few different currents of the river coming in. So basically right now we're just going to tell a story that happened like around five years ago. So when we were coming back home from town um, after tea, we saw these massive as black clouds just in the distance, just black as and we kept on driving home, probably like 10, 20 minutes later, we saw just a flicker of lightning just in the distance. We didn't think much of it, and then as we got further in into the storm, we saw more and more flashes of lightning, and we started seeing fork lightning. And eventually just there's lightning everywhere, lots of cool different colours. Most just this green because we were quite young at the stage. I was like, oh, it's just lightning, it'll be fine. And then just, out of nowhere, probably like 10 meters from the car, it's just a big flash of lightning. It was like, I believe it was red or something. I think it had like a steel pole inside the road. And I could see the smoke come off it, it was that close. And then I started freaking out, so then it just started pouring down the frame. And it just kept getting extremely intense, and then it stopped all of a sudden. But yeah, now I'm not too fond of lightning when I'm outside just because I don't really want to get stuck obviously. So whenever I see like storm clouds and stuff coming, I just want to get to shelter now. So yeah, that's the story that happened. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the story. So we just continue on down the river. So enjoy. Okay, everyone, so now we're just heading back home um, just because it's starting to look pretty dodgy, the clouds, and we don't want to rain. And um, it looks like on Google Maps, because we do check Google Maps, Google Earth, before we um, set out, it looks like it was pretty. Looks like there were like lots of pools and stuff that we had to cross, and it just looked extremely annoying. So, there's this part that we can get onto, like a little bit downstream that. We can get onto the road and then we'll just head back home. Alrighty everyone, so now we are off from the river because we found the part where we can get out and back onto the road, just up here. We could keep on going along the river, but that's just Gonna take way too long. Oh, there's a bit of a steep over here. Just having the trees help me up. So now it's a lot easier from here on. There's a massive as trees just up here. So see as we may get back home. Alright everyone, so I hope you have all enjoyed this video um, of us exploring the river, having a good time. Do you have anything to say, Stephen? Uh, yeah, it was really fun. Too cold. Yeah, and we didn't bring our dogs. Um, so basically, make sure you hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. Comment down below if you have got any suggestions or just if you enjoyed this video. And also subscribe, check out my Instagram, click the description below. So have a good one, see you and bye bye.